golfing indoors. Good morning, Jamie. Ooh, yes, so good morning, Pooja. You know, a lot of guys and women probably put their clubs away because it's starting to get a little bit chilly. But you know what? It's okay. Thankfully, there's places like the Metro Golf Dome. This is a beautiful 50, uh, 53,000 square foot indoor facility. It's heated. And uh, yeah, this is a great place if you want to work on your game on the off season. And thankfully, I got guys like Dave Hartman from Power Lesson who are here to give me some tips. Dave, great to it's, see you again, it's Dave. great to see you. No, no stranger to the show. No, um, not at all. You know, as I mentioned, a lot of people are putting their clubs away. Yeah. Don't do that just yet because we've got this great facility and you run a winter academy. What do you guys do? Absolutely. It's called uh, powerlesson.ca. It's our golf academy. And the best thing you want to do is you want to maintain your swing during the winter. A lot of people figure, okay, I hit my goals in August. They put their clubs away until May, and they got to begin all over again. So you've wasted all that money and time. You come in and see us probably once a month, minimally, as a maintenance program, or twice a month to develop and increase your ability so next year you'll be that much better. And you know what I love about this place is not only are there putting greens, we got Andre who's working over there. Short he's, game area. He's chipping away. Yep. There's also the golf simulators, which are great if you, wanna, if you wanna do an indoor round, but uh, we're here on the putting green. Uh, and as always, you know, I always gotta work on my putting game and you've been watching me swing away. Yes. You think I can get a few tips for this segment? Absolutely. I think the big thing is we're gonna have you putt this little six, seven footer. Okay. What I want you to do is have a little narrower stance to the shoulder width. Okay. Ball in the center of your stance. And you had a good piece of advice, uh, you know, for shorter distances, close the stance, close the stance and up. then slowly, gradually open it. Exactly. And, further. and then you're going to have the putter go back from the center of your stance to your back foot. Okay. And then have the putter just move past your forward foot. Kind of a 40% mm -hmm. motion going back and a 60% accelerated. And keep my head. Through. Nice and centered. In the and back line of up ball. the dot with the ball. Correct? Absolutely. All right. Let's, let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. I had a pretty good one right off the top of the I segment. saw that. Right in the heart. And that's why you got to get Dave Hartman to help you out for some golf lessons. You know, I'm looking forward to this because uh, I didn't really get a chance to hit the links all summer long. It was a You're a busy, busy man, yeah. I'm a busy man, but you know what? I'm glad to be here. And also, if you want to find out more information about his awesome uh, lessons and tutorials, powerlesson.ca, and you guys offer these great things where you get to film people, send them their swing, critique it, analyze it. Uh, and so Absolutely, anywhere in the world. You know, basically, you can be with us here live and get lessons from us. You can be at holidays and capture your swing on your smartphone. Email and send it to us, and I can give you a lesson anywhere you are in the world at that time within 48 hours so Fantastic. you can improve. Well, all good. We're going to be here all morning long. Metro Golf Dome. I'm going for the long ball as I send it back to the newsroom. Let's, the see. Water Let's see how good this one goes. That's perfect. All right, guys. 40, 60. Back to you. Excellent. No! There we no! go. Long leg. Little left, little left, little left. Thanks, Kenny. There you go. Hold on one. Perfect. Hold on one. There you go. That's how I play golf, Jamie, just like that. With a cameraman to help me out. Well, I'm going to like this. I, 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 I uh, golf as well as I ski. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see if Jamie does any better, because he's golfing. Wait, are you a good ski? Okay, I'll, later. Uh, Jamie, what's up? What are you doing? Good, good morning, Pooja and Steve. You know, normally this is not the place you want to be uh, when you're playing golf. You don't want to get stuck in the sand trap. It is not an easy shot, but thankfully I got Dave Hartman to help me out how to get out of the sand trap, my Good friend. To see you again, Jamie. You know, we're here at Metro Golf Dome, and I had an email uh, off, off of, in between commercial breaks from one of my colleagues saying, drooling, where is this magical place? It's 401 in McCowan, 53,000 square feet, and you know, everything from driving uh, to putting and in the sand trap. Exactly, 125 Milner Avenue. So it's a great spot. This is like Florida sand here. Mm -hmm. It's great to practice these areas. I'll give you a little pointer here. Mm -hmm. Normally in sand, it would be nice and manicured and with no footprints. You want to play that ball a little forward of center in your stance, kind of where you play so it kind of just on the inside of the right leg. Exactly. And choke up a little bit of grip down the okay. club. And you want to hover the club about an inch, inch and a half behind the ball, mm -hmm. hands in line. And just a nice little three-quarter back swing and follow and, right and through the sand. We don't want the club to go under like that. We want it to kind of hover just it, over the sand. Exactly. So that it can hit through the sand first and follow right through, make a full follow through and take some sand, Jamie. And fall right through. That's perfect. A little too much. Absolutely. That's oh, look! Well, look at this. We got BBB over here. You, I didn't know you knew how to manicure. <laughs> yeah. Wow. So what I basically do too, Jamie, is for a lot of my amateurs and beginner golfers, like you want to just get out of the sand and advance it. So I give you kind of a standard position where you stand, choke up, have your feet level, club face square, and you turn and follow through. 
as you get more advanced in your skill set, you can actually put the club down, open the club face up, mm -hmm. then grip it, open the alignment of your stance, right, and just try and turn and follow through. And you can control yeah. the distance better, right? Go in the hole. A foot and a half away from the from the hole. And the great thing is, you know, a lot of people are thinking golfing season is over. Almost, technically, there's still maybe a couple of days left, a but uh, maybe a few. But uh, you have a winter academy that we want to tell everyone about. You can find out more information at powerlesson.ca. And from here, we're going to move over to the driver coming up in our next segment. You want to stick around for that. 100%. That's all from the Metro Golf Dome. We're going to send it back inside to the newsroom. Perfect. CP24. <laughs> wow, that's really interesting. You know, we were uh, talking golf this morning, and uh, when it comes to your golf swing, they say it's all in the hips. And I guess we have to ask Jamie Goodfriend, uh, you know, are you are you like Shakira? Your hips don't lie? <laughs> no, they, they lie. Straight up. They're lying oh, okay. to you right now, Pooja. <laughs> we are here at Metro Golf Dome doing a little golfing this morning. You know, a lot of people probably put their clubs away, but it's great things. It's a great thing that there's a facility like this uh, at 401 and McCown. This is 53,000 square feet. So, uh, Dave, we've been working all morning. Yeah. And, you know, I've worked with Dave on several of these live eyes. And in between, uh, in between segments, we work on things. And I can't tell you how much I improve just like that within minutes and so we've we did a little bit of putting we did some chipping in the sand in the sand trap uh, now we're gonna take the ball for a little bit of a ride exactly we're gonna hit like basically a middle length iron and we want to do basically jimmy's have that ball nice and centered in your stance mm -hmm. feet about shoulder wide and just lean the golf shaft a little bit forward of the club head you show me how it's done okay so i got the club good grip i followed my pre-shot routine so your fundamentals are sound and it's just turning and completing your swing and compressing that ball solid. That's yeah, that pretty good. So one of the one of the things I sometimes have trouble with is actually hitting the ball that's right off right off the, uh, the ground off surface. the ground surface. So it's a little different. Uh, and also, always remember, keep your head down, right? Absolutely. Don't that's take your eyes off the ball. You make a nice shoulder turn. Right. So we're going to give it a shoulder turn and follow through. Beautiful. Look at that. Right See, that's what I'm talking away. about. I'm actually not a golfer. But this man you turns me into it. Uh, it. A little bit about the Winter Academy. This is a great way for people, you know, who, who tend to put the clubs away, and then all that stuff that they work on throughout the summer is out the window by next season. 100%. I try to achieve goals with all my students, and what happens is, if I don't see them for two months, four months, six months, I've got to start right back at the beginning to get their goals back. So if you can come into the Dome with me, come and book us for one of our assessment lessons, contacting us, we can build your swing, maintain it, and improve you, get new goals for next year, instead of oh. achieving the same ones we've already done, which is a waste of time and money for you, come and keep it going with us, and you'll be a better golfer guaranteed. I hit the sun. As um, Jamie. And that was the goal. That was the goal. And the great thing is, we got Andre, who's just kicking back right here, and he's actually filming this. And, the, and you've, in the past, when we were up at Markham Green, you guys filmed me. Yes. And then you sent me a, an, analysis. A, a, an analysis. Tell us a little bit about the analysis and what people well, were The seeing. beautiful thing now is with technology, uh, you can capture your golf swing, as we did for Jamie, on your smartphone from two different angles. You can even tell me what you want to have done. I'm slicing it. I'm not hitting it solid enough. And I can then give you a swing analysis, critique it, and give you a lesson live and back to your phone within 48 hours, anywhere in the world you are. For yourself, corporations can give it away as prizes or gifts. It's phenomenal. And once again, you can find out more information at powerlesson.ca. we got for one sure. more. We're going to be heading over to the golf simulator. We're going to be taking the ball for a very long ride. A long drive championship competition between me and Jamie. Stick right? around for that. I'm we're nervous. Just, we're <laughs> going to send it back to you guys for now. Perfect. Jamie, thanks very much. Indoor golf. That's what you're doing, and that's what we're doing here as well. Jamie, by the way, doing indoor golf here. Look at everybody. Bob? <laughs> CP, uh, what, did, what did Jamie say? CP24! Wow, wouldn't that be great if I went up and hit a light? Hey, listen, uh, I'm going to practice my golf swing. You go get a coffee or whatever it is that you need to, to wake up if you're just waking up or get yourself going. And we'll have birthdays, milestones, just a couple seconds. Don't go away. Actually, for a person who doesn't golf, I think I have a good swing. Oh. Yeah, the 
course the pirates are on the green. Okay, of course they are. Uh, I think we could use a lesson, and uh, Jamie you could, Goodfoy... You, you could use well, a lesson. You could also I'm, use I'm, a lesson. I'm, I'm just a caddy. I'm pretty sure that's not how you carry the bag. I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but Jamie Goodfoy is getting the lesson this morning indoors, and uh, he's improving his golf swing in front of us. We've watched him grow throughout the show. He's transformed! He's a you. professional golfer. You know it, guys. I've been having a blast here down at the Metro Golf Film. Check out the simulator. This is a, a great way for you to get a round of golf or even hit the driving range during the winter. All right, just a little bit to the left. And the cool thing about this simulator is to actually tell you exactly how far. So that wasn't too good of a shot. That was only about 147 yards. But the cool thing is that you can actually play Pebble Beach, St. Andrews. This is a great way to even just sit down, have a couple beverages, Absolutely. and play around. You can bring some friends over, you can have yourself you know, a beer or a glass of wine and some olives like some of my Greek friends like to do, and just have yourself a wonderful time here indoors playing one of those courses you mentioned. You know, one of the, uh, the first thing, you know, when you hit uh, any any um, uh, particular uh, golf course or particular hole, mm -hmm. you gotta you gotta send the ball for a run. You gotta hit it with your driver, depending on the length of the, uh, the hole, but you wanna Absolutely. just give me a few tips, because uh, my friend, you, took a couple ones well over 300 yards not an easy thing to do but what what is the form what is the, the few tips that i need to know absolutely that's another reason why it's important to come in and get training all winter because you want to be fundamentally sound especially hit a, a driver nice and solid i have my little checklist take my grip have the ball opposite my forward heel feet about shoulder width arms hanging down nice and comfortably and just make a nice and wham bam solid swing they, and dead straight yeah Dead straight. Maintain perfect balance and uh, just hit that ball nice and deep and have some fun with it. Right? I'm going I'm to give that one more go. And uh, don't forget, people, if you want some uh, winter lessons, Dave's got this amazing winter academy. By the way, that was 288 yards. Not a bad Actually, not a bad 315, shot. sorry, Jamie. Oh, sorry, 315. Yeah, that's okay. I didn't want to shortchange you there, Dave. Uh, but, uh, and, and the great thing is, you know, people who, who work on their game all summer long, they take the winter off. And then they lose some of those fundamentals during the winter. But this, you have a great way to keep them busy. You got to keep going exactly all winter with training, hundred percent. Well, let's see how this one does. Oh, there you a go. Bit better. Much better. That's a little more straight. Absolutely, better turn and a good solid finish. Well, now it's out let's there. Let's see what my distance too. was. The distance was. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, we are 200 yards. Not bad, not bad. Yeah. You know, Dave, we've had such a great time here down at Metro Golf Dome. By the way, 53,000 square feet. Uh, everything from pitching, we got people driving, people in the sandwich. Uh, you know what, guys? I feel bad, though, because I kind of made a little bit of a mess. I hit a lot of balls out here, so I'm thinking, I think it's time for me to clean up a little bit, guys. So I'm going to play a little game, 10 bucks, to see who can hit the live eye reporter. Guys, you've been watching CB24 Breakfast. Who wants to go for a ride? All right. All right. There we go. We're going to send it back to you in the newsroom, guys. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Now you're a moving target. Woo! That makes more fun, Jamie. Yeah, I'm glad you got moving there. Yeah. Is this a good idea? Well, he's in a cage. I think. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, he's in a cage. Well, yeah. that makes it better. Yeah. Well, I'm just yeah. thinking if they remove the cage, then it would be something completely different. It yeah. really would be. That Jamie. You know what, what scares me is how quickly turned into a good golfer. I know. Yeah, it just goes to show that if you just get some lessons, you can get better. We should have done the, the golf whisper voice while we were throwing to him. Well, um, as we go to break, you told us what we're going to do. I'll do a soft golf clap, okay? Oh. 